What is going on everybody? It is E-Rock here bringing you guys another H1Z1 video. As you guys can tell by the title today, we are talking and showcasing the new skins coming out in the new crate coming very soon within the next uh, patch update coming up. If you head on over to the test server, you guys are going to be able to see all the skins I'm talking about. I'm going to go over them very briefly, very quickly, and give you guys my opinions of them. So first of all, if we go to character, go to appearance, hit that gear button, and we'll start out with the helmets coming into the game. We have the Risky Business motorcycle helmet here. Looks pretty clean. Pretty, it's probably going to be pretty cheap. We have the Nautilus diving helmet. Now this thing's going to be way too big for me to wear, so uh, probably not one I'm going to want to go with, but uh, let me know what you guys think. This is the one I really want, the Nemesis Aviator helmet. It's the Nemesis... Yeah, the Nemesis Crate, I believe, is what they're calling it. This thing looks so dope. I can't wait to get my hands on this. And then next, we have the Invil Infiltrator Advanced Helmet here. Um, looks kind of robotic and kind of look like some of the Call of Duty characters out there. But, uh, I mean, hey, I think it looks pretty nice. Uh, next, we're going to go over to the uh, Jackets. I'm not exactly sure all of them that are included in this crate. I want to say this golden dragon warm-up one is a part I could be completely wrong so don't don't take my word on that one but for sure we have the risky business suit we have the Natalis jacket and we have the nemesis tactical jacket um, and also we have the infiltrator tactical shirt uh, I think these look pretty sweet um, actually I actually really like the this one the most it's a little bit different it kind of reminds me of like a snakeskin kind of look uh, that's just me personally <laughs> next we're gonna look at the backpacks we have two military backpacks coming in we have the Nautilus survivor backpack some black or I mean some brown with some aqua blue looking color I, I don't really like the the big poofy backpacks you got going on here but and then we have the nemesis explorer backpack everything of the nemesis looks just so sick I really want this backpack <laughs> oh my god all right, we have a couple pairs of pants here. This is why I think this this one's in this crate because it's listed first. The Golden Dragon warm-up pants. Not sure, like I've said before. Um, we have the Nautilus cargo pants. This outfit looks pretty dope. I mean, it's, it's brown and tan and boring looking, but I think this thing looks sick. Then we have the Nemesis padded pants. Uh, I think the black in like. The splash orange effects look really good on these pants. I think they're. I think this outfit might be pretty expensive. That's just me. Uh, it could be pretty cheap, but I think it might be a little expensive. And then the Nemesis padded pants uh, again looks pretty sweet. Moving on, I don't think there are any gloves. Let me just double check. Oh, there were some padded gloves, but no one really cares about those. Um, and then we have some makeshift ar or some body armors here we have the nemesis tactical body armor this dude looks like a football player or <laughs> he looks so poofy i could not wear that i just think that looks so absurd and then the infiltrator advanced body armor i think looks the best out of the two then we lastly have some makeshift we have a makeshift armor the desert warfare makeshift armor i think this looks kind of bland but i mean i guess it's it would probably be cooler to have than the blue if you don't want blue. And then the two best skins coming out of this crate, you guys, are the two gun skins. We have one, the, N, the Nemesis AR-15. This thing looks slick as hell. Oh my god. It reminds me of like the Black Ops 3 theme with the black and orange. Oh, just, just observe it for a minute. Oh, it's so nice. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, enough of that. But that is the Nemesis AR-15. And then the last one we have here is the Natalis 12-gauge pump action shotgun. We got the blue underwater effect. This thing looks dope. I need to get my hands on all of these. Let me know what you guys think of all the crate items coming to this game very soon. Let me know what your guys' favorites are. I know we really want them to fix the game, but they're giving us some skins too, so I guess we can't be too upset. Uh, if you guys enjoy the video, make sure you leave a like rating and subscribe to the channel. And as always, 
I'll see you guys in the next one.